Hi everyone, my name is Matt and last year I started a charity to inform people in developing countries about the environmental disaster that is plastic pollution in our oceans. We managed to secure a $10,000 per year funding grant from Google to spread the message which has been a great success so far. This year we have a plan to physically turn off the constant stream of plastic waste from the world's most polluted rivers. Now, you may have heard that the amount of plastic entering our oceans on a daily basis is quite frankly depressing. In fact, there is so much that by the year 2050, there will be more plastic in our oceans than fish. Plastic kills just about everything and it doesn't break down for hundreds or even thousands of years. But what you may not know is that 70% of this waste comes from just five countries. The top 10 rivers account for nearly 30% of ocean trash. Amongst the worst is the Ganges River in India and Bangladesh. The Ganges runs through vast areas of countryside, picking up plastic waste from cities along its path until it reaches Bangladesh, where it narrows at a town called Chanpur before it hits the ocean. So, after six months of research, we have a plan to install machines able to collect most of the plastic that passes through the river. What machinery? You might have heard of a machine called Mr. Trash Wheel. It's a machine created in the USA designed to trap and collect plastic using a boom and conveyor belt system. It's already being used with great success in the US, but now we need these machines where it really counts. Our plan is to use five Mr. Trash Wheels spread across the Ganges River at Chanpur. Now, bear with me for a second while I quote you some figures. With the plastic we collect from the Ganges River estimated at around 150,000 tons per year and sold at the current market rate of $350 per ton, that equals $52 million. Now, you might be thinking, are you serious? I can assure you that yes, this is absolutely true. Now, you might also be thinking, okay, but is there a genuine market for all this plastic trash? Is there a willing buyer? Again, the answer is yes. Bangladesh's many clothing factories use plastic to create a clothing material called viscose. It also goes into car interiors, cooking utensils, and many every other day products. So, this is what we want to do with our Kickstarter request. Our team will travel to Bangladesh to show local government not only how they can be a world leader in recycling, but how they can get $50 million injected every year into their economy with this program. If we can stop it in the Ganges, we will push this program worldwide. With this extra money, we will get it off the ground. So join this program on Kickstarter and let's get started getting rid of the world's plastic pollution problem now.